Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. This is going to be my first ever Let's Play video, and I'm going to be playing The Sims 4. And I have here a family that I created based off of a song, and I thought it would be a really funny idea to create uh, a Sims family based off of that song. But anyways, if you haven't heard the song, it'll make more sense if you listen to it, so I'll link it right here. And so this series is going to be, is going to revolve around two families here, the son and the dad, and the daughter and mother, which I created separately already. Um, I already created them, I'm just trying to show what they look like here and create a sim. This is Steven Sims, and he he's a he's a family guy. He's a very domestic kind of guy, and he he aspires to have a successful lineage, which is definitely gonna be happening here. Um, he's unflirty, which is ironic because he wants to have a family. Uh, he's a goofball, he's a funny guy, and he likes music. I'm actually going to have him learn the guitar throughout the game. Uh, let's see, I don't really have to show his outfits. We'll see them throughout the game, but here they are. And his dad, I'm not really happy with how I designed him, to be honest. Yeah, he, he looks pretty boring. I kind of sped through uh, creating his outfits. I even ended up using some of the default styled looks that they have over here because I didn't feel like uh, spending so much time on him. But yeah. Without further ado, let's uh, play this game and see how crazy we can make this family tree. So this is where they live. They kind of live in the middle of nowhere in this desert. And neither of them have jobs yet. They also only have a total of $17 in household funds, so that's pretty bad. Um, I'm probably going to give the dad just a basic job. And I'm going to have the son sell a bunch of knickknacks during yard sale yard sales, excuse me, and also through tips on playing the guitar. Um, but we're actually going to put this family on hold for now because we need to take care of something first in the second family. <laughs> Mitzel Benarla. Mitzel Benarla. So this is family number two, the second family that this series will be following. And this is the Reyes family. This is Lucy. She's the mother of Rose, and these two are going to be the main characters. This guy, we're actually going to kill him off in like the next five minutes if we can. Uh, his name's Leo. His personality and literally anything else about him is not important. In fact, his entire wardrobe I just kind of randomized until I got things I like. Because he's not even going to be here for a long time, so don't get attached to him. The reason I'm killing him is so that uh, Lucy becomes a widow. And plus, it's just, you can't have a Sims Let's Play without killing somebody, so... We're gonna work on that now. That's going to be our objective in this episode, is we're going to kill Leo. I also need a little bit of time to get used to some of the characters' names here. So you're Lucy, right? You're the mom. You are Rose, you're the daughter. And, uh, this guy is dead. There was actually a fire in this house while I was doing some test recordings, and that would have been the perfect time to kill him. I wasn't even thinking. We wouldn't even have to be doing this if I had just killed him in the first place. So I'm going to create a little fenced-off area for him here. Yeah, right next to the mouse hole. He's going to have a fun time here. And we're just going to starve him to death. That's all we're going to do. We're just going to see how long he can go without eating. Man, this is a sadistic first episode, isn't it? Alright, you just stay right there, Leo, okay? Uh, don't mind the <laughs> the construction people coming by. Perfect. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, I'm sorry, Leo, but your family doesn't like you. It's just, you know, there was a there was a construction accident while they were renovating their apartment, and Leo got stuck somewhere and he just unfortunately didn't make it. Uh, what was that sound? Somebody leveled up, I think. We're probably going to have to fast forward here a lot. But, you know, in addition to the weird family tree, I also want this to just be a Sims Let's Play. Like, I want them to do stuff. I want them to, to have fun and go out and just be Sims. And maybe some fun stuff will happen along the way. Like reading books and gaining logic skills. How are you doing there, Leo? He has his phone. Oh, that's right. I downloaded a mod. Uh, just a texture mod to make it look like they have an iPhone. Is he playing this? Excuse me? Hold on a second. He's playing The Sims. Hey, Leo. He's playing The Sims, uh, what is it called? Sims Mo Mobile. Look at that. That's so weird. I think she's also playing The Sims. No, she's on social media. She's on Facebook. She's on Simbook. 
trolling the forums. Um, you pronounce their last name Reyes, by the way, not Rice. Yeah, so some fun first episode, right? You got mom here watching comedy. You got the daughter trolling Facebook. And you have this guy playing The Sims on his phone. We're gonna have to fast forward. And I'm definitely gonna be putting jump cuts in this series. A lot of them, because in The Sims 4 there's a whole lot of nothing happening at some points. Either that or I just can't think of anything to say. There you go. Please go to bed. I think it takes The Sims a whole 24 hours once they reach critical hunger to die, so this might take a while. In the meantime though, we can't leave the household. We have to stay here. Or at least in this general area of the neighborhood. Um, otherwise, he is just gonna do whatever he wants. Oh, he's already getting hungry. Nice. Our next objective after killing him is going to be... Uh, I'm gonna go back to the Sims family and I'm going to see if I can find these guys anywhere. Because we, we need to meet this family. We have to have both members of the Sims family meet both members of the Reyes family. What is she making? Are those tater tots? For breakfast? This apartment is really crappy, by the way. Like, it's actually really bad. It has the lot trait of needing TLC, which means things break, things go wrong, there's cockroaches every now and then, there's mice coming out of the mice holes. It's pretty gross. What's the matter with you? What? Here, go pee if you really want to. And have some breakfast. We have so many leftovers. Like, you have no idea how many leftovers this household has. This is what started the fire. She was trying to make some grilled fruit. Rose, I mean. Rose was trying to make some grilled fruit. Oh, you're hungry? Oh, I'm sorry. Should I give him a toilet? I... <laughs> I don't know. This is his jail cell. He just has a bed and a toilet. And he's just constantly going on his phone because he has nothing better to do. I'm sorry, Leo. It has to be done. We need to progress the story. Oh my god. <laughs> What's the matter with you? She's tense because the fire is out. Why is that making you tense? Shouldn't that make you calm? Okay, here, have a toilet if you really need to pee. Although it would be really fun to watch him wet himself. I, d I just don't want to hear him complain. There. Better? That helped him progress his fabulously wealthy aspiration. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna have to fast forward for now because there's not really anything to do. I mean, we could go down here and have Lucy play some b-ball with, um, <laughs> Brant Hecking. I also play as these guys in my own personal game. I had them adopt a little daughter. I named her Joanna. Or we can have her, uh, listen to Yumiko Sasaki play her guitar. Come on, you guys. No, she's watching the romance channel again. Please. Enough. What is she doing? Oh, They have like nothing to do, so they just keep hugging each other. Oh my, we, we gotta find something for her to do. Maybe she can play the piano? Maybe Rose can learn the piano while Steven knows the guitar. Oh no, those two aren't gonna be a couple. I forgot. It's gonna be Rose with Steven's dad. She's not very good. She can't even play a normal major scale. You can't even play a C major- Excuse me? The C major scale is just literally all white keys. She's like pressing some black keys in there. Introvert. Have a sim do nothing social for 24 sim hours. It's probably this guy. Although he does have a phone. He's probably texting people. Oh, wait a minute. He doesn't know people. He knows- he knows Myra Trivedi, though. Oh, because that's the landlord. I see. I was like, I'm pretty sure I didn't send you out to talk to anybody. And you might as well just go to sleep since you have nothing better to do. And the rest of the family is going to sleep. So we'll be able to fast forward time faster if he sleeps. See, it like goes ultra fast forward. Only if everyone in the lot is asleep and there's no one else. So if we had like a visitor and they were just watching TV, we couldn't do that. Is this? Oh. Oh, that's right, the vampire. <laughs> I have the vampire pack. Um, in my game, I have all of the game packs installed. At oh, hey, hey, can you... No, we don't need a vampire right now. He's thinking of Leo. <laughs> can I just, like, ask him to leave? 
Also, this is annoying me that he stinks, even though it really doesn't matter. I'm gonna <laughs> replace his toilet with a shower. Or just move the shower here. Temporarily, and have him take a, take a quick shower so he stops stinking. There we go, thank you. Did he- did he pee himself? He still peed himself, or I don't know what that is. It's nasty, though. Alright, go to bed. Put this back, we don't need that anymore. How much time is left? He is still not ravenous yet, so it's still two more hours to become ravenous, and then another 24 hours for him to starve. Oh, good morning, Lucy. I originally named her- Oh no, there's cockroaches. Where are they? I originally named her Lucia, uh, but I just decided to say Lucy for short, so it's a little easier to say. Oh, you're not gonna get rid of those cockroaches just by spraying them. See, she made it worse. <laughs> what were you spraying them with, like... What were you- Why are you talking, talking to Yasmin? Where even is Yasmin? She's out in the rain! Where, where did she go? You're, you don't even have your umbrella on. This family's a mess. Yeah. You're creative? Well, can you please come up with a creative way to kill these cockroaches? While she's barefoot, no less. That's, that's really, that's really brave of you. Yeah, she did it. Okay, thank God. Yeah? Uh, sorry, Leo. I can't do anything about that. You're supposed to get into a construction accident. <gasps> you guys! Oh my god, I forgot to put the food away. Now it's all spoiled. <laughs> to just throw it away. What a waste. Whoa! Oh, she's angry. She's angry because we wasted food. They're both making food. <laughs> they keep making food, which is good because their cooking skill will go up, but we have leftovers, don't we? Yeah, we do! Why do you guys keep making food? Are you proud of yourself? You made... Eight servings of hot dogs, when we already had like seven servings of grilled fruit that you made yesterday. Or maybe she's traumatized from the grilled fruit because that's what caused the fire so she doesn't want to touch it. I wonder if, because he's just over a fence, if they can talk to him while he's in there. It's a little sad that he's not getting any, any of his social needs up. Yeah, that's what's sad, that his social needs isn't going up, not that I'm starving him to death. Nope, they can't- they can't talk to each other. This is too much of a barrier. Are you watching the romance channel? Oh my god, stop watching the romance channel. Watch cooking! I wish the other channels gave them skills too, just like the cooking and comedy channel. Like the sports channel, maybe it'll give them fitness skill. Maybe the romance channel will give them, uh, charisma. Maybe the politi po politics channel will make them <laughs> lose charisma, I don't know. Starve to death in 16 hours. We are almost there, folks. In the meantime, let's have him pee again. How come moving the toilet here, it did something to his aspiration? I don't know what it was. We didn't gain a new item, dude. We just moved an already existing item. She's playing Tetris. She lost. Rose's quote of the day is, Date a girl that reads books. She's <laughs> reading Orbital Pudding. All of these book titles are like parody names for actual book titles. Like, for example, The Lord of the Swings. What? What's wrong? Oh my god, we have cockroaches again. Where are they? Ew, they're back! Five more hours. We're getting really close. Four. Three. Two. Okay, I'm gonna have to slow down for a second here. Because I have to destroy this. 31 seconds. Oh no, he's dying! Wait, oh, I didn't get- uh. Damn it! I forgot that it ultra fast forwards, so he's dying already in his pajamas, and while this fence is still here. Wait, I didn't get a chance! Well, I guess you guys can still see him? No, they can't see him because he's beyond a wall here. No, you guys won't even get a family member die. That's so sad, and something smells like rotten eggs, apparently. <gasps> They can't even see him! They don't even know what's going on! Wait, can the Grim Reaper even get in here? Are you guys okay? 
How, how do you feel? They're just irritated because of the the rotten egg smell. How do I how do I get rid of it? I mean, this is low on my priority list right now, but it is annoying them and by extension me. So, by the way, when I record this game, you can't see my cursor. Um, you can just see me click on things. There you go. Attempt to repair. I think this is I think my plan is backfiring because I don't think the Grim Reaper can make it in here. So now we just have a corpse living in our house, indefinitely. And I can't save the game, or anything. Okay. Yeah, that's how I feel. The cockroaches are back, are you serious? <laughs> They're making weird noises, by the way. Oh. Oh. Okay. Aww, they're very sad because of a loss in the family. Aww. It's hard to see those closest to us pass away. Rose can find some solace by mourning at a tombstone or urn. No, it doesn't make them feel better. It just makes them more sad. So we didn't get to see the Grim Reaper come by because I put him in a weird corner of the house. And I forgot to remove this. So by the time he died, it was too late. I'm sorry, you guys. I, I really messed this up, didn't I? Well, he's dead. There he is. He's right there. Rest in peace, Leo Reyes. I'll put his urn here, I guess. Alright, well, we did it. We completed our objective. The Reyes family is now very sad. And their house is just a mess. There's a rotten egg smell over here. There's cockroaches over here. There's plates just scattered all over. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I had to do this to you. But now, now, Lucy, you are now a widow. So, you match the lyrics of the song now. She's still feeling embarrassed and angry. Is she crying while playing Tetris? I just heard a <laughs> noise. No, she seems she seems all right. She doesn't seem to care very much. Well, we're done here. This is all we needed to do. So now we're gonna have to check back at the Sims family. So once again, we return to the Sims family. And we're probably not going to go back to the Reyes family in a very long time because this is going to be the main household that we play as. And we're just going to get some time to get to know these two characters because we're going to see them a lot. And later on, I'm going to go have them go out in town and see if they can find either member of the Reyes family because we're going to have to get to know them and we're going to have to start this family tree pretty soon now that we have the, the foundations. Oh my goodness. Dude! I love watching Sims cook, especially when they have shitty skills. I love watching Sims do anything with shitty skills. Let's see how badly he do he uh, screws this up. Come on, you can't mess up scrambled eggs. Oh, he's doing really well. The fact that he's uh, in a happy mood is helping. Oh, or not. <laughs> I spoke too soon. How's the dad doing, by the way? I think I sent him to go jogging? Yeah, he's doing alright. How'd the breakfast go, by the way? Normal. He created a normal plate of mac and cheese. Uh, I guess I'll have him play the guitar for a bit, and meanwhile, let's go have his dad find a job. Okay, I think the best job to fit him would be in the culinary career, because it's one of the lower paying jobs to start off with, and you start off as a dishwasher, and I think, I think that works pretty well for this family. All right, you are now an assistant Dishwasher. Wow, not even a dishwasher. An assistant. You are gonna be some kind of freelancer, I guess. I'm not giving him a job. I'm just gonna have him play the guitar and also do some yard sales every now and then. In fact, here, let me do something. Register with the Ministry of Labor. That's a new feature they added, I think, so that they can have a job title without actually having a job. Um, he is a... Professional yard sailor. How do you, yard salesman? Oh, I can't fit it. I'll just have to say yard sailor. Yard seller? Well, it makes it sound like I'm selling yards. And I can't even fit it. So, <laughs> professional yard sailor. Enter job description. I sell things in my backyard. My front yard. There we go. So, uh, should I have them go out or should I probably wait first until- He doesn't start work until two days? Why not? Why can't he start now? They have seven dollars. They can't even- they- they can't even go out. 
Maybe I'll have him play his guitar for tips. Yeah, but he sucks. No one's gonna give him money. <laughs> he knows he's bad. Look at that face. This is pretty terrible. Like, if you were seriously, in all earnest, trying to learn the guitar, I don't think you would ever sound like this, ever. Though, to be fair, it's a little harder doing a scale, a major scale, on the guitar than it is the piano. Because on a piano, you just gotta press all the white keys. Provided that you start in the right place. How can he see the TV from here? Oh wait, why don't I just do first-person mode? Yeah, The Sims 4 has first-person mode now. It's really bad. It's pretty awful. Oh my god, like, you can really get some serious motion sickness from this. How about you? Oh, no, no. It's kind of an interesting neighborhood they live in. It's kind of like a, a pit stop area, because you see there's some cafes here, some diners. Big old dinosaur statue. This is this is very uh, midwestern, in my opinion. Is he getting any better at all? He's level two now. He's kind of getting a melody now. I don't know what he's playing, but he's getting somewhere. He's playing. He's playing. Bring back my Bonnie. Oh, he's he's doing good now. Good job, Steven. He's still pretty crap, but he's doing better. I'm gonna have him go out, take his guitar with him. He's still feeling pretty embarrassed about his performance, but that's okay. Let's see if we can't have him go to a bar or something. Maybe he'll meet um, Lucy there somewhere. Let's go somewhere in San Machino, because that's where they live. I noticed that a lot of played sims like to go to the gym, so maybe we'll have a good chance of finding her there. And it'll give the dad some time to work out too, so let's try that. Our next objective here is to find the Reyes family. Oh, Lucy. Rose. No, we just have <laughs> Genji Sasaki. I've heard that last name before. Are you related to uh, this lady that we saw earlier? Oh, there's a protest. What are you protesting? I think she's protesting about housing prices? No, I agree. They're, they're pretty terrible. Here. She's playing for tips in the rain. Oh, her last name is also Sasaki. I think this is the lady we saw earlier. She's really good. Steven, we need to get you to that level. Maybe I can busk for tips too. Bring some competition. Here's Brant Hecking again. Oh, and his husband, it looks like. Alright. Practice. Hey everybody, let's calm down for a bit. Listen to my guitar music. I'll play Bring Back My Bonnie. There's a lot happening right now on screen. Oh, oh, oh. Must have a guitar. I do have a guitar. It's in my inventory. Okay. Oh. Oh, needs level 4 guitar. Wow, Steven, good job. It turns out he sucks too much at the guitar. Let's just get out of here, find somewhere else. Uh, where else would a recently widowed woman hang out? Probably the bar. There's a lot of those in Windenburg. Although it's kind of early. It's like, what, 2 p.m.? Maybe she's dancing the night away. At 2 p.m.? Let's go there anyways. The Sims don't understand a concept of time. You'll find Sims partying at like 7 in the morning. He acquired the charisma skill. Why? I didn't do anything. Alright, this is where all the cool people hang out, it looks like. Aww. 
Well, he, he is feeling a little unsocial right now. Maybe, maybe dancing will help you out. Let's just pretend it's later than 2 p.m. right now. Oh, is she okay? She like, need herself in the ear. Okay, Lucy, where are you? Lucy? No, she's not, she's not at the club. That's not where she likes to hang out after being recently widowed. Oh my God, these two guys are wearing the same outfit. How embarrassing. Now we could spend ages waiting for Lucy to show up or we could do something else. All right, the cafe. If we don't find her here, I don't know where else we will. Hello, I would like to order one macchiato. One caramel macchiato, please. Hey, I guess his shift is over. Are you the barista? Yeah, he is. Okay, good. Because I would, I never got my macchiato. Oh, I just realized we only have seven dollars and we can't afford half the things here. That's right. Well, I'm just here to use the restrooms. Oh, what's that? The restrooms are for paying customers only? Well, I can't do that. He just gained social from peeing. That's disgusting. We're seeing a lot of the same people that we saw earlier. Like, we have Mama Fires over here. Ooh. Maybe I can steal someone's coffee. Take it, take it, take it! Take it, oh! Oh, wrong sim. I, I meant to play as uh, this guy. Take it, take it, take it. Yes, oh my god, I just stole someone's coffee. I'm the worst. And we still gotta keep our eyes peeled for Lucy. Sometimes they're not really on the lot. Sometimes they're just out here walking. Especially in big lots like this. You know, I could just go over to their house, but that's unrealistic. Wow, he just stole food without me telling him to. He's eating a, uh, a scone. Well, this is perfect. If they ever run out of money, I can just have them eat here. There's our good friend Yumiko Sasaki again. But no Rose and no Lucy. All right, let's, uh, let's move on. We're not making any progress here. Now she could be hanging out at the solar flare, at the lounge. Oh, I just remembered this is primarily a place for old people to hang out. Also, there's Sims 2 music playing here. I like this lot because they like to play Sims 2 music on the radio. This really brings me back. Hey, this is the... The Sims 2 University theme, I think. That was one of my favorite games. Anyways. While you guys have fun, I'm gonna go look for Lucy. This kid is in two clubs. This kid is like eight years old and he's more popular than I am. In re and he has an iPhone. It's like the size of his head. No, I saw her. I saw her. I, I was just like yawning. And then I saw her for a split second. She vanished. That was her! I know that was her because I, I gave her that dress. No, I missed my chance. This could have been it. Oh, this is gonna be a long episode, isn't it? Okay, let's try here. Wait! Wait! Oh, that's her right there! Hello? Oh my god, I finally found her. So, this is her hangout then, I guess. What is this music? This is like Sims 2 Remix. Is that a- is that a piñata? What is this place? She's- she's still very sad. Should I cheer her up? Well, well, is that a good idea? Will she hate that? Oh, I'm sorry about your loss. You wanna talk about it? Oh, cheer up. Oh, was that awkward? I'm sorry. No, that was fine. Now she's feeling focused. I don't know why she's feeling focused after I cheered her up. Awkward hug. <laughs> Let's get to know her. That's right, I have an awkward sim. Just like I am in real life. You know, I see myself in Steven. <laughs> I just heard something break. You okay there, Lamar Townsend? 
No, no, oh, Nancy Landgrab, why'd you have to sit right there? She wants to go dance now. All right, well, let's dance together. Oh, sorry, I interrupted your eating. How did you get that? You don't have any money. He just bought a bowl of chips for free. Maybe the bartender felt bad for him. Dance skill acquired. Well, she doesn't have dance skill either, I just realized. All right, we're getting to know her. I kind of don't like the slot because it dips down, so when I rotate the camera, the camera kind of, like, bounces up and down because it doesn't know where to rest. It's a little annoying. I, I'm sorry that bothers anybody, but I can't quite do anything about that. Awkward hug. Oh, no, oh, she wasn't feeling it. Unflirty sims get tense around flirty sims. And seldom get flirty themselves. Aww. For sims with this trait, it is difficult to love and be loved in public. In public. Hmm, so if we get her... If we get her alone, then it should be fine. Now, if you know anything about The Sims 4, you'd know that the easiest way to earn any kind of social points whatsoever is to ask them to cloud gaze and or star gaze. So let's do that. Alright, now watch that social bar. Oh, that's right, you can't see my cursor. Watch the social bar up here at the top of the screen. Watch it go from like uh, 20% to like 50. And just like that, just from looking at the stars, we're already closer friends than it could ever be like in real life. No, is she leaving? I think she's leaving. Oh, I was gonna say, wow, the stars are beautiful tonight, but that's actually just snow. <gasps> no, she's gone! I, I look away for one second and... Oh my god, it's the cat lady. Yeah, there's there's a cat lady that came with the pets expansion, I think, and she actually has cat ears. She usually wears a hat, so you don't see it, but I guess since she's wearing her party clothes, <laughs> you can see her cat ears now. She's really funny. Well, that's enough for today, I think. I, I think it's time to send these guys back for now. Is he a... S what? <laughs> He's taking a nap on the couch. Oh, you poor old man. Well, time to go home anyways. It's two in the morning. What a fantastic day. We we practiced guitar. We met Lucy. We found her at this place of all places. You wouldn't think that a grieving, recently widowed, uh, middle-aged woman would be here, but we found her here. Yeah, we also killed Leo, Lucy's husband, and I think that's a lot of progress for now. I guess up next, we're just gonna work on their relationships a little more. Aw, you guys had a long, long day. Oh, that was... Oh, it's fast-forwarding. <laughs> I was like, you got into bed really quick, didn't you? And yeah, I, I hope this episode wasn't as boring as I thought it would be. And we'll definitely catch up later uh, with the Sims family and progress the story from there. But for now, I'm just gonna end this video because we're done. We, we accomplished everything we wanted to accomplish today. <gasps> Let's go to the city and take in a show. Hell yeah! What a great way to end the video. Alright, bye guys.